Day everyone, welcome back to the markets, the crypto flight edition of this channel. Your fellow passenger here speaking with you guys. I wanted to stop in and make another video about this because I truly don't think people have caught on to this just yet. We got a little bit of activities going on in the altcoin section, but I mean, this thing is really about to rip, guys. The altcoin market cap is about to go up at least 100%, guys, a minimum of 100%. And I think a lot of people have lost interest in the altcoins, and which makes me a lot more um, enticed and ready to enter the market as I have been scaling into a few positions in the altcoin section. But again, I don't think people see this. A lot of people are gonna miss this move, guys. As I mentioned, excuse me, BTC is gonna see a 16 to $18,000 BTC um, I said that near like April 2020 and people were calling me crazy and BTC right now is at just under $16,000. The same thing I'm going to say boldly, make a bold statement right now that the altcoin market is going to increase its market cap by 100% from the current levels, guys. We're going to get into that in a little bit more. Stick around to the end. Let's not waste any time and let's dive into the charts here, shall we? All right, so today's November the 6th, 2020. The current market cap of excluding BTC is $156 billion, okay? All right, so it's now, so everything is pretty much the same. Actually, it kind of looks different. Uh, that October the 1st, I think it was 31st, right here. Like this candle right here. For whatever reason, we don't have like that large wick above that candle anymore i don't know it's kind of weird like it, it comes and it goes away i don't know what they're trying to pull guys but i've already seen enough evidence okay in the charts to suggest that this thing is going to go up a hundred percent so yeah there's no need for me to see anything else so yeah that's pretty much all i have for that but i truly want to just make another video because i'm, I'm i can see it now people are starting to say the altcoin season is back and all this stuff and they're probably like two months behind when I see this thing happening unfold within the past week I've seen this unfolding right here in front of my eyes so I just want to keep you guys up to date if you're holding altcoins um, I can't give you financial advice okay this, I'm not your financial advisor but what I will say is the market cap should experience a 100% increase in the overall market cap excluding Bitcoin and um, that's basically what I'm seeing happen. How long would it take? Okay, let's do this. Since I have these few lines here, let's erase this pink line here. Assuming that, I think we can erase this green line as well here. No need for that. I like my clean charge. There we go. That's a lot better. A little OCD there. Okay, so if we're going to assume that this yellow line here is going to act as support as it did all the way back in May 2017, that's pretty obvious to me at least. I don't know if I could get a zoom in there for you guys to see that. So just before that parabolic move up, the price action gracefully touched this yellow line uh, in the month of April 2017 and May 2017. After that, I mean, it was almost like rocket fuel. I mean, to the upside it went. To, I mean, so far to where, you, I mean, you can't even see that those bodies down there, the candles bodies. And these are monthly candles, okay? So, and as you can also see within this range here in January 2019, little clustered area of price action near the line. We broke below it, got back above it. Another clustered area here in between September 2019 up to June uh, 2020. And these price fluctuations are going to be between 47 billion up to 95 billion. Okay. So I think it's pretty safe to say that. This yellow line acts as a relevant level, whether it's going to be support or not. I mean, so far it's above that line, but of course, anything can happen. It can break below that line and potentially find resistance and just go to zero, right? Uh, sorry, Moon Boys, for the altcoins. I have to be realistic about this stuff, guys. Um, so let's just say, let's just entertain the fact that this yellow line has potential resistance for now, okay? So all I'm just trying to do is just trying to put a time on it here guys so what i'll do at that point is i'll take this candle the previous aggressive buying interest in the markets candle let's see here something like this one right here okay that one right there since the candles are currently respecting uh the body of that candle it's pretty much staying above it is what i mean when i say respecting the body so i'll put a horizontal line on the chart right here 
And let's just say that, you know, big boys, they want to just consolidate until we find our next back test of support. That will look something like this. We'll do a sideways consolidation. And then once we hit that yellow line right there, okay, you never know. We may have some more rocket fuel left on that line and then boom to the upside. Okay. So this is based on if I could put a time on it. Let's just say at the worst case scenario, if the $127 billion line holds as support and potentially a consolidation level, we could see a move to the upside. Um, and it'll be very explosive because, again, that, I would consider that as a, um, a level of consolidation. Okay, like this entire range, if it were to just kind of stay on that $127 billion line, I would consider that as consolidation. And that would give it the necessary time to, I mean, really build up that momentum. So when that rocket fuel is sufficient, you get that blast off to the upside. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't see that as being, um, you know, out of the ordinary for me in my book. But I don't, honestly don't think it'll take that long. But if I had to put a date on it, or a time frame rather, I'd say somewhere at least before September uh, September the 1st, 2021, uh, the price should be well over $200 billion market cap, excluding BTC in the altcoins here. So that's all I got for you guys. Like I said, if you're holding altcoins, I'm scaling in. You're probably selling to me. Um, if, you know, that's if you're considering selling um that's all i can say about that guys can't give you financial advice but i really do and antici i'm anticipating a very aggressive move at least 300 billion dollars i mean maybe there'll be resistance at that line when it gets there maybe it won't right we just have to wait and see what happens and let the price action determine the next move okay so that's all i got for you guys thanks for joining me here be sure to leave an appropriate thumb just below the video there leave it in a comment down below subscribe to the channel if you haven't already the pulling macro i'm gonna go ahead and sign off thanks for tuning in guys uh, my loyal subscribers thank you L new subscribers welcome in guys thank you for joining the channel and i'll talk to you guys next time take care of yourselves click the video on the screen make sure you watch that make sure i'm staying consistent with a thesis on the channel and i'll talk to you guys next time take care